Hey guys, Ryan here. So today I'm going to be talking about my collecting journey over the years. So it started off way back in preschool when I got into Dragon Ball Z. And I would watch the show every day after school, which is really fun. And um, I got like action figures back in the day, and I actually still have them. So that's pretty cool. Um, and yeah, I'm wearing my Dragon Ball Z sweatshirt with Goku and Frieza on it. So yeah. And, um, yeah, so that's where it kind of started for me. And I would, um, I would get the show in Jump Magazine, like this one right here, from October 2004. Um, and yeah, I got this signed by the voice actor of Goku, Sean. So that's really cool. And what's great about Show and Jump Magazines is that they have previews, yeah, um, Beat the Vandal Buster, I believe it's called. And there's different series. You got like Hikaru no Go. Love the art style for that. We got Shaman King. We have Yu Yu Hakusho. Yu Gi Oh! So many classics. And Dragon Ball Z, of course, which got me into manga and anime. So yeah, one of the first series I started collecting the manga for was actually Naruto. And that was when manga was 8 bucks. So yeah, now it's 10 bucks. So the prices have changed a little bit. But I'm still a collector at heart. And yeah, so I was into Naruto, I was into Bleach. Bleach was like my favorite series in like the fourth grade. And I absolutely loved the anime. And I loved reading the manga especially in the show and jump magazines and um so yeah that was like my favorite back then and I really wasn't into One Piece until like a few years ago um in 2017 which was the same year that I started doing manga hauls on my channel so yeah manga and anime and figure content and yeah this is like one of the first figures I got in 2017 of Fire Fist Ace And yeah, I have a Mega House version of Fire Fist Ace, which is really nice. Comes with like flames, it's got like the tattoo on the back, and you can like pose them however you want. So yeah. Um, so yeah, I've been collecting a lot of more um, anime figures for my stop motion videos, and um, you know, with whether I uh, pick up a manga series or pick up a, a anime figure, I want to put it to use. So, yeah, most figures I get, I, I get them for videos and also if they're really cool to collect. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I would make manga hauls every month or so or combined months. So, yeah, I've been collecting different series. So, Christmas of 2020, I got like the Dragon Ball Z manga box sets. My first manga box set, I think it was either Claymore or Bleach. So we got that here. So that's really cool. My favorite thing in my collection though, I would have to say, is my One Piece manga box sets. Because that's my favorite manga series, and I just absolutely love it. So yeah. And yeah, so I've been collecting manga and anime and action figures for a really long time. So, yeah. And I've written down some ideas of series I want to collect and get this year or the next, basically for the future. So, yeah. Some of those ideas are like the bleach box sets. I want to get those for sure. So, yeah. And, um, yeah, I think that does it for this video. So, you guys will have to let me know your collecting journey, how you got into manga and anime, how that all started for you. Like, I'd like to know what series got you into manga and anime. That's my question. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, peace.